friends, welcome to Let's Talk in English on PTS. Get ready to learn something new today. I'm Andrea. And I'm Gabe. And we're still with our friends in Hualien at the night market. Let's get ready to learn some key words. The first one here today is duck. Quack, quack. Duck. We saw some ducks by the water. Follow. Follow. I don't know where you live. Can I follow you home? Right. Right. Are you hungry? The restaurant is right here. Toy. Toy. My little brother plays with a lot of toys. Winner. Winner. Don ran faster than everyone else. He is the winner. Memory. Memory. Our vacation was fun. We made a lot of great memories. Well, friends, follow us as we say these key words again. The first one is duck. Quack, quack. Duck. Follow. Follow. Right. Right. Toy. Toy. Winner. Winner. Memory. Memory. Okay, uh, now what's next? I heard a duck. Uh, Where is the it, duck? It's time for Eddie. Uh, oh, that's right. Uh, My memory is so bad sometimes. It's time to find out what today's mission will be. Eddie, you uh, heard a duck? I heard a duck. Where's the duck? Quack, quack. Huh? There quack, it is quack. again. Really? Right, Eddie. Uh, well, maybe you'll find the duck later, Eddie. For now, can you give us today's mission? Yeah. Okay. All right, here it is. Today's mission. What does Patty love? What does Patty love? <laughs> well, you know what I love. I love finding out the answer to the mission each day. Let's go and see if we can find it today in today's lesson. Let's go now. What do we do next? I have an idea. How about fishing? I love fishing. You know that. What kind of fishing? Duck fishing. Let's go catch some ducks. Great idea. Patty, you have to try this. We can catch ducks here at the night market? <laughs> yes, follow me. I'm right behind you. Okay, so we've got some key words here, and we have found the answer to today's mission. Andrea? Yes, Gabe? You're following me. Well, yes, I'm right behind you. I'm following you. Okay, that's okay because you just used one of our key words, and I used another one. Let's look at the word follow. Follow. When you follow someone, that means you are behind them. You follow them. I was walking behind Gabe, so I was following him. Now, friends, let's use this word. Follow me. When you tell someone to follow you, you want them to come with you, and you're going to show them where to go. Tom knows the way home. Follow him home. Or... Follow the bees if you want to find the honey. Or that car behind me is following me too closely. It should slow down. Well, Grandma says that she is right behind Roger. Let's look at this word, right. Right. Right here, the word means definitely. You can see her. So she's right behind him. You can see her. She's really there. That's true. We often say, I'm right here. 
Hello, I'm right here. You want to make sure that someone sees you. And you can say, I'm behind you, or I'm right behind you. Both are okay. You can say, the restaurant is here, or the restaurant is right here. It's all okay. That is true. It's okay. Well, friends, we see another thing in this conversation. Our friends are duck fishing. Now, that is interesting. That is interesting, and that's a good key word, the word duck. Duck. A duck is a kind of bird that also can swim on water. We found out that Roger wants to go duck fishing. He wants to catch ducks. Now, I want to know what this is all about. Yes, and we found the answer to today's mission, what does Patty love? Well, actually, Gabe, we didn't find the answer yet. We did find out that Grandma loves duck fishing. Come here, little duck. Patty, they are toy ducks. Why are you talking to the ducks? It might help, and it's fun. I caught another one! That's ten! <laughs> ten ducks? I'm still trying to catch one. Grandma is the winner. Is this a game? Yes. If you catch the most ducks, you get a prize. <gasps> I got another one! <laughs> Well, our friends followed Roger to the duck catching game, and now we understand this game. Gabe, what kind of ducks are they fishing for? Well, they're not real ducks. They're only toy ducks that they're fishing for. That's right, toy ducks. Well, friends, let's learn this keyword together. It is toy. Toy. A toy is something that you can play with. Children like toys. They like to play and learn with toys. You can use this word like this. Buy some new toys for the baby to play with. Or, I have a dog and my dog likes to play with little toys. And I have a picture of some toys right here. There's a toy dog and a toy phone with some other toys. Well, that is neat. Now, it's true that usually children or pets play with toys, but Gabe, do you have any toys? Well, uh, some. Some toys. I have some toys. Okay, and that's okay. Yes. Even when you're grown up or when you're an adult, you might still play with toys. Well, we know that the ducks are toys or toy ducks, but Patty is still talking to them. That is interesting. We also find out that Grandma is the winner. Our keyword is winner. Winner. If someone wins something like a game, then we call that person the winner. And Grandma is the winner because she got 10 ducks. She won. She is the winner. Woohoo! You can say, I'm the winner. Grandma, you chose a really cool prize. Here you go, Patty. This prize is for you. It will be a special memory of the night market. And of catching ducks. Thank you, Grandma. I love it. Okay, what's next? Let's go shoot some hoops. Great, and I can get some fun pictures. Well, Patty can get some fun pictures, and she will have many great memories from the night market. Friends, let's learn this word. The word is memory. Memory. Your memory is how you remember things, or it's what you remember. That is your memory. In our conversation, Grandma tells Patty 
that the prize will be a special memory of the night market. So when Patty looks at the prize, she will think of all the fun times she had at the night market with her family. Patty will have some special memories from the night market. Now, special memories are good memories. If you have good memories, that means you like to remember or think about that time. Well, we found something else that's special in this conversation, didn't we, Gabe? Yes, we did. And that is the answer to today's mission. Finally, the mission is, what does Patty love? What does Patty love? Patty loves the prize that Grandma gave her. Song time. Quietly you come, quietly you go. Sometimes you are fast, and other times you're slow. To some you're generous, yet most don't really know how to stop you from running, always on your toes. Quietly you come, quietly you go. Sometimes you are fast, and other times you're slow. To some you're generous, and most don't really know. How to stop you from running, always on your toes. Lord is come and evenings go. You let people live and grow. Conversation Replay. chose a really cool prize. Here you go, Patty. This prize is for you. It will be a special memory of the night market. And of catching ducks. Thank you, Grandma. I love it. Okay, what's next? Let's go shoot some hoops. Wait, and I can get some fun pictures. Calendar phrase.
Andre, I am so excited about tonight. We're going out with some friends. But, Andrea, we have to eat somewhere. Where, where should we go to eat? Oh, well, let's eat at the night market. Before we can eat at the night market, we have to talk about today's calendar, calendar phrase. phrase. The phrase is, let's eat at the night market. Let's eat at the night market. The night market is a good place to eat. There is lots of food at the night market, so you can use this phrase when you are at the night market. Let's eat at the night market. Well, now let's review this phrase with our skit. Let's eat at the night market. Let's eat at the night market. Where do you want to eat dinner? Let's eat at the night market. Oh, that's a great idea. I love to eat at the night market. Me too. There are many interesting foods. I can't wait. Let's eat at the night market. Oh, I'm excited. Let's eat at the night market. But what will we eat there? Good question. Let's eat some of everything. Let's eat at the night market. Let's eat at the night market. Okay, friends, now it's time to practice what we've learned today with the question of the day. That is with Eddie. Oh, oh yes, yes, here it is. The question of the day. Do you want to try duck fishing? Why or why not? Yes, I want to try duck fishing. I think it would be fun to catch toy ducks and... Toy ducks are pretty cute. Thank you for joining us here today on Let's Talk in English on PTS, where learning, learning English can, can be fun. fun. Goodbye. Bye-bye.